Raju here for techpp.com and today we will be doing the first ever unboxing of the latest Lenovo Yoga tablet uh, which was announced uh, just a couple of weeks back uh, in uh, New York by Ashton Kutcher. Uh, so here is the 10 inch version of the uh, Yoga tablet. Uh, this is an Android uh, powered tablet from Lenovo and uh, they are for some reason they are using the yoga uh, brand name for that uh, i think that is um, mainly to do with the multi mode uh, concept which was uh, made popular by the yoga series of uh, notebooks so uh, this is uh, the uh, review unit which we have received from uh, lenovo and uh, as you can see uh, they try to portray uh, the multi mode uh, features which uh, come with the yoga tablet uh, 10 uh, which we have here and there is also the 8 inch version uh, which is pretty similar to it but uh, comes with a uh, lower battery and uh, other things so we shall take a look at the specs later on uh, let's see uh, the boxing which is pretty neat it, it is uh, having uh, the image on the top Lenovo on the side, some uh, information about the serial number and stuff at the back and uh, Dolby branding as well. So let's go and uh, open this package. Uh, unfortunately it was, uh, the seal was removed by the custom so makes our job pretty easier. So here is the Lenovo Yoga tablet so remove the cover it looks pretty pretty cool i mean something very different to what uh, we have been seeing in the tablet uh, in with regards to the form factor we shall take a look uh, later on um, along with this we have the charger of with the usb data cable and uh, this is uh, the typical US uh, charging point. And what else we have? We have the quick start guide for Yoga Tablet 8 and Yoga Tablet 10 with uh, different languages, product information guide, some usage key. I mean, this comes with a different form factor with uh, the kickstand and also some uh, guide for that the optional accessories we have a couple of them over here one uh, the keyboard cover and uh, the sleeves so we, we shall take a look at that as well and the guide to install the sim it supports uh, 4g lte so that's pretty cool so we should keep this aside as well what else is there so that's pretty much it not bad we don't uh, have the headphones or anything uh, with this just the charging and uh, charger and the usb data cable so let's take a look at the tablet itself here we go so it's a nice looking uh, tablet it's a 10 inch version and uh, looks pretty slim the weight is uh, pretty good I mean uh, it's not too heavy but it's not too light either um, when you compare it to something like the iPad Air uh, I don't think it's as uh, light as that but uh, it, it feels really good to hold in hand you know in, in a single uh, in a single hand mode it feels very good to hold uh, this is uh, the hinge which comes over here which also acts as a kickstand so if you want to watch something on a movie or something so this is a nice addition to that uh, this is pretty similar to what we had seen in notion ink adam which never got popular as such and we also had something similar in uh, sony's first android tablet the sony tablet 
uh, which also uh, didn't get too popular. So the, there is a camera at the back, and uh, this this hinge, uh, this handle, also acts as uh, the additional battery pack. Uh, so it comes with eight six thousand mAh of uh, battery, which is supposed to run up to 18 uh, hours uh, at a stretch uh, with different usages in the sense of uh, Lenovo is uh, talking about the ideal usage of say two hours of uh, music playback three hours of uh, movie playback some internet browsing and so uh, adding all of those uh, it comes to 18 hours of battery so that's okay we, we shall uh, take a look at uh, how the battery performs in uh, real life uh, usage uh, there is a micro usb charging port on the left on the right there is a 3.5 mm audio jack volume keys and uh, this one is pretty plain at the back we have uh, the lenovo branding and of course the uh, kickstand which is pretty pretty neat and uh, there is a charge uh, sorry uh, the slot for uh, the micro SD card and this one is uh, it's a Wi-Fi version so we don't have the uh, slot for uh, the slim sim so and there is a speaker on either sides over here and uh, let's try to power it this on Now, for while it's powering on, uh, let's talk about uh, the specifications. It comes with a 1.2 gigahertz uh, MediaTek processor, a quad core processor uh, from MediaTek. That's a surprising choice uh, in the sense that uh, Lenovo is hoping to pitch this against uh, the likes of uh, Galaxy Tab and iPad. Uh, in that sense, uh, it's kind of surprising that Lenovo chose a uh, MediaTek uh, and not something like welcome snapdragon uh, so this is the skin on uh, the lenovo yoga tablet uh, not too different from the other uh, skins we have seen on lenovo smartphones uh, like the k900 uh, it doesn't come with uh, special app drawer everything is merged with the screen itself and uh, has some preloaded apps like the Amazon Kindle, Kingsoft Office, uh, and Navigate 6. So th these are uh, some pre-built apps which comes with uh, the Yoga tablet, along with some anti anti uh, virus features like the Norton, and that's pretty cool. So uh, let's go and take a look at uh, the version of Android running it's running the Android 4.2.2 which isn't the latest but uh, it's still running the Jelly Bean so uh, that's about the software and about the battery as I mentioned it's uh, having 6000 mAh of battery and it comes with a camera 5 megapixel camera at the back and uh, one 0.2 megapixel I believe on the front for video calling and uh, stuff like that so I shall take a detailed look uh, at the yoga tablet and before we wrap up let's see uh, what we have here this is the Bluetooth keyboard cover with uh, which comes which, which doesn't come I mean it, it, it's a separate accessory which one needs to buy uh, so this is for the tablet 10 uh, which we have here so let's go and uh, unbox this as well has some details on the serial number and stuff and some specification like it's just 5 mm thin touchpad with uh, right and left keys uh, smart sleep and wake up 75 days of battery life Again, I mean, it's a custom calculation done by Lenovo. We, we need to see how good the 
and and accurate this particular number is so and comes with bluetooth 3.0 so let's go and take this out so here we go so what we have we have uh, the data cable i think this is to charge uh, the keyboard battery and also we have the product information guide bluetooth keyboard cover uh, info okay, nothing too important anyway let's keep that aside and uh, take out the Okay, so this is very light. I mean, I have seen quite a lot of uh, keyboard docks uh, in recent times uh, from Logitech and other other uh, third-party players. But this one, this one is really light. I mean, uh, I don't know the exact weight of this uh, keyboard dock, but uh, it feels very, very light in hands and uh, very slim as well as I as they mentioned on the. Um, box over there it's just 5 mm thick and has a rubber uh, thing on the here i think this is to make sure that it doesn't get the scratch and also it's a nice thing so i think I, i need to figure out how exactly this thing works Oh yeah, so there is a magnet uh, over here. So I'll try it. it gets attached like this. Or maybe I need to take out. It's kind of weird. I don't know. I let let me figure out how to use this exactly. Um, but anyway, it's a Bluetooth uh, thing, so can work by pairing the tablet with the keyboard dock. Uh, we shall take a look when so uh, we uh, do the actual review which should be in few days from now uh, so and okay uh, before we end there is one more accessory which we have over here uh, this is the sleeves it's a white color one they also have the orange one i believe uh, so oh okay and it also comes with a screen guard Uh, for the tablet that's a nice addition to give uh, for the sleeve the sleeve costs around 49 dollars if i'm not wrong i, I shall uh, put that out uh, info in the description below so those this is a nice leathery feel it has a nice leathery feel and has a magnet over here so nice again okay so let's We, we shall be back with the actual review and we shall see how good the tablet performs in uh, real life scenarios because uh, the specs are not uh, that attractive to start with but anyway the actual performance uh, might might not uh, disappoint us i'm really hoping that this is uh, really good it, it retails at around 249 dollars in in us uh, the 10 inch version comes for uh, 299 and in india the prices start from 23000 and the 10 inch version will cost uh, the uh, around 28000 so so that's a pretty premium uh, stuff from lenovo the build and all looks really good it feels really solid in hands and uh, doesn't look fragile at all the aluminum uh, finish uh, makes it look really good uh, but we shall see it in detail once we uh, take it to uh, take it down our tests and see how well it performs so till then it's raju signing off